Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to the um, to the My Friendly Cities project launch event. This is a very exciting project which we're uh, thrilled to be part of, and we're thrilled that you're part of the launch. Um, one in five people here is born outside of the UK, and that's something we take pride in. We take pride in our communities. The cultural diversity of the city, and indeed the region, is something I'm immensely proud of, and it's exciting to be here today to celebrate this exciting and successful collaboration supported by EU funding, which helps to make Coventry, Birmingham and Wolverhampton the first migration-friendly cities in Europe. So, what is a migration city? And what do we think about it? What does it look like? I want to make sure that no matter where I live, if somebody has a negative attitude towards me, my neighbour, my friend, my colleague, and my community comes forward and challenges them. And that's what we see our migration friendly city to be. And that's what we envisage to deliver in some ways through this project. So it's not just about refugees and migrants, it's about the whole community. And that's one of the important messages we want you to take away from here today. We want you, me, all of us, our neighbours, our communities, to be really working together and be able to share our voices, to share the skills we have, but most importantly, share our passion so we can all work together and invest in the future of the region. In 2015, I arrived in Coventry as an asylum seeker. I believe with the assistance of the My Friendly Cities project, a lot of opportunities will be created for migrants and refugees and they will be enabled to unlock their full potential and contribute to society and help change the world. I am grateful that I live in the UK and especially in Coventry. Um, it it teaches you every day something new. It teaches you how to accept others and it, it tells you that we come in our, in our city. You are not alone. You are not a refugee. You are a human being who just needs a safe place and a good opportunity. Now, of course, the thing we should reflect on is the cities of the West Midlands have always been places of migration. But it's interesting to think that the theme that has consistently driven that migration is always been about toleration and about opportunity. But I do want to say that I appreciate how difficult it is for migrants to integrate in our society. I'm very excited that the scheme will be really practical. It's also a brilliant example of what Peter said of a team coming together from across the West Midlands. You see all the brands on the panel in front of you, the cities, the charities, the universities, exactly what we should be doing, working together on these big, big issues. The outcome, quite simply, if I can demonstrate it here, we can genuinely make advantage of our diversity to create a community in which everyone